lean that weight down. Your heart rate is going to go. Excellent. Now we go. Here we go. Down and up. Down and up. Do a very good job vlogging today. Yeah, I got my hair cut. Today was a really long, like not very productive day. I slept in, worked out, I made some jam, and then I went to my hair appointment and then we ran some errands and that's it. So it wasn't very exciting. Jamin's hanging with the boys right now. <laughs> So, I'm just chilling. Just chilling. It's a very chill. Look how cute it is. Are you kidding? I feel so sassy. I feel like I really do feel like more like myself when my hair is short. I just love it. Okay. I'm pretty sure I can't put my hair in a bun. Bones are out of the question. Bones are out of the question. It's fine. I'm not mad about it. <laughs> oh my gosh. That was huge. I haven't used this in a while. I don't really think this 
that damn does anything for me, but I like to put it on. She lives in daydreams with me. Oh, there it goes. Hi guys, I'm Aubrey. Um, I'm from Sacramento, California, and I am an elementary education major with an English minor. And I'm really excited to take this class because I love grammar and I'm excited to know all the grammar stuff. <laughs> Good. All right. What was that? Do you know the password to the closet? No. Is your camera? No. It's not. <laughs> <laughs> Try 0841. What? Try 0841. Did it work? I know what it is. Hi guys. Okay, I know I haven't like said anything this whole vlog. Technically, yesterday was the first day of school, but neither Jamin or I had classes yesterday. We did do school related things yesterday though, and we got like all of our syllabi read and just got things prepped for 
the semester basically and got ready for the week. We even went on campus and got some books and things done that we needed to there and campus is so weird right now. It's such a weird feeling seeing everyone in masks and seeing like so little people on campus i guess it's, it's a totally different feeling than it usually is when we go to school it was kind of sad yesterday <laughs> today i had two zoom classes and then the rest of the day we went to clean one of the cabins obviously and then after that i did some homework for a little while did homework ate some yummy pizza that my husband's dad made for us now i'm just back home i've been laying on my bed just playing on my phone and relaxing for a while because it has been such a long day now i just want to tidy up my house it's very messy and it's crazy how fast it got this way i think that's the last thing i'm gonna do tonight and i'll probably won't film me cleaning but i'll show you some before and afters i'm taking 14 credits taking four classes one of my classes is six credits and it's my senior practicum and i actually haven't started it yet i have a meeting with my class tomorrow and we get assigned to an elementary school i won't know until tomorrow where i go and then i don't start until next week but starting next week i will be in a school from i think 7 45 until like 4 15 on Mondays and Wednesdays. So I'm there the whole school day before school starts and after school ends with my mentor teacher. And I'm really excited because I feel like this is really gonna give me that like teaching experience that I've been waiting for. So that's super fun. And then on Fridays, I do have an on-campus class for the same one where we meet with her professor for a couple hours. But other than that, my classes are all online. Two are classes that I have Zoom meetings for. And then I have one online class things are really busy my husband's also taking 16 credits our job with cleaning cabins is busier than it's ever been even in the summertime and so things are wild but i'm so grateful today's been a long day first day of the school you know when like your life is just super busy let's say you're taking classes <laughs> and working and you know doing all the things and like every night when you're trying to go to sleep like your mind is just like going and going and going. So I haven't really had that for the last five months until last night. Last night, I think I tried, I went to bed at like 11, maybe past 11. I haven't had that experience like that until last night and I just caught myself thinking and thinking and thinking and being like, oh, like thinking about time management, like how am I gonna do this and this and this with this and this and this and have time for the other stuff that I like to do, blah, 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 you know? and it's been that way for years but then after the during this break i just felt free and comfortable and didn't feel anxious and like all this and now it's all like flooding in <laughs> and so i'm trying to cope and manage with that and i feel like i'm doing a pretty good job like way better than i normally do it's interesting like having these feelings come back there were multiple times throughout today where i felt very anxious and started to be a little bit stressed which is kind of funny because it's the first day and we hardly have anything with school you know going on the first week but just like the thought of what's to come yeah not gonna lie there were a few times today where I was feeling a little down about that oh college college is fun college college man hmm. So it is definitely bedtime because it's like 12.30. Oh, I was not planning on staying up this late. My goal was to go to bed at like 11, but I kind of got carried away with cleaning my house and instead of like quickly tidying things up, I like 
swept and mopped and cleaned out the microwave i turned on some youtube videos on my laptop and just kept watching them as i cleaned and i really enjoyed myself so i'm not mad about it i was very therapeutic and i feel like it definitely helped me de-stress i feel really good i feel a lot better than i did earlier today about being stressed with classes but that was my first day of school technically second but yay <laughs> definitely wasn't ready for school to start <laughs> but here we are um i really want to make a vlog of when i start doing my senior practicum senior practicum isn't student teaching it's like before student teaching and then like at the end of your senior practicum you take what's called an exit interview that allows you to go on to student teach well maybe i'll make a vlog when i start doing my senior practicum thank you so much for watching i really hope you enjoyed this video if you did please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel because i do post videos regularly thank you so much and i'll see you in my next video bye guys